Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying three Cuglies. These are lollipops. Cuglies are a cross between cute and ugly. Cuggly. So, we have the strawberry, the blue raz. And I have watermelon. So these were sent to us from Joanne, and she uh, uh, she owns the uh, Sugar Rainbow Company. And their website, she sent me a sheet of paper with cheat sheet. Uh, their website is www.yolocandy.com. And so what the deal is with these is you have a uh, little animal on the inside of each one of these containers. But then the cool thing about these containers is you can use it to store your lollipop. Mm. So if you if you don't eat it all in one sitting, you can store it inside. So we'll show you that. Um, so lollipop with surprise figure. They're so ugly, they're cute, it says. 18 different Cuglies figures to collect, 18. Mm. A uh, great tasting lollipop with a surprise cuggly figure inside. One of the cutest, ugliest animals on the planet. Uh, it says they are 90 calories each and they're made, made in China is what it says. Okay, so there is a perforated part on the side and you just pull that and it opens very easy like this. And so that easily pops. Oh my goodness, look at that. <laughs> is that a bulldog? A bulldog. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah, he's a bulldog. Okay, and so you get it. No, I'm not cheat it. sheet on the inside. Oh my goodness, what is that? Okay, let's see. Oh wow. Uh, yeah, bulldog. Well, this they uh, they mislabeled this one because they're calling this a pug. Yeah, that's not a pug. That is not a pug. That's a bulldog. Uh, well, the reason we know that is because we had a pug for fun. years and years and years. <laughs> and this, um, I mean, he, definitely not a pug. He looks similar to a pug. Yeah. But he has uh, jowls, and um, yeah, pugs don't really have jowls. Pugs really don't have jowls, and his head is bigger. Uh, the the whole shape of the head is different. Um, let's see, let's see what's in this one. And you don't know what you got? I like some kind of hairless mole rat or something. Naked mole rat. Yeah. Oh my goodness, what? the wrinkled hairless bodies. Some may say the naked mole rat looks like a hot dog with teeth. <laughs> oh, a hot dog with teeth. That's hilarious. Okay. I like how the suckers go. They got like little holes. That... <gasps> oh, so you could hold it with that. Yeah, you hold it like this, and then when you want to put it Well, up. I mean, or you could put it, you have it, leave it on there and eat it like yeah. that. Yeah, it Just up. like that. Um, so this is, what is this one? Yeah, if you want to. You this one, I don't think is on the sheet. Is it? It's on, no. I was thinking it might be that bug eye thing, but he doesn't really have bug eyes. So you, there's 18 to there collect. It it's like a red fox or something. Right, so there's 18 to collect. So there's gonna be, I don't, they only have six of them on this sheet. Uh, those are very, very cute. And ugly. Um, and uh, very ugly, yeah. Well, the mole rat is the mole rat just ugly. terrible looking. Uh, he would haunt your dreams. Uh, but the other ones are really cute. <laughs> um, so, what you would typically do is you would eat it like this, to where you don't even have to hold the stick, or you could store it uh, inside. So, you take it off, store it like that, and it's clean. What we are going to do uh, is we are going to, you see them like this, Kevin is going to take them, he's going to break them up, and then we are going to be trying them in pieces of candy because it's just easier for us to get a, a chunk of candy, um, a hard candy and eat it that way rather than trying to, because you get more flavor that way. If I can put a whole piece in my mouth and chew it up, I'm gonna get more flavor than just sitting here licking on this for 10 minutes. You know, I'm just gonna get more full flavor. So we're gonna break these up and we'll be right back. I like these containers too, because once you're finished with your sucker, you could these could be their home. I like it that they have a home. Something else that Kevin and I noticed about this that makes it not a pug is the teeth. 
The teeth, I'm going to post a picture, a close-up picture of it, at, of these at the end. The teeth are actually coming up out of its like mouth. Tusk. And <laughs> yeah, a pug is, it's just not like that. Yeah. But since they say these are from, made in China, that's pro. they might call them pugs in China. But here, that, that, is, that is not a pug. That's a bulldog. Uh, that's a bulldog. Okay, so we have watermelon, blue rose, and strawberry. Let's try strawberry first. Tell you what, it smells good. Mm -hmm. And they're very pretty. Hmm. If you've ever had the strawberry candies that are wrapped to look like a strawberry, that's exactly the mm -hmm. same flavor. It's good. It's very good. Kids would love that. Mm -hmm. It's a very I sweet like strawberry candy flavor. Okay, blue rasp. I don't know if you got us some really good small ones or not. Mm. And that is Jolly Rancher Raspberry. Mm -hmm. That's good. You know, I think for I years like the strawberry they didn't even have a raspberry. No, I don't know. I don't think they had a raspberry when we were kids, when we were younger. I don't remember. What do you think of that? That's good. That, it's, uh, I like the strawberry better, but I do like that one. I, I like the strawberry better too, but the raspberry is nice and it is strong. Uh, mm. Let's see. This one is watermelon. That's my favorite. Mm. While you're eating these, by the way, if you eating the sucker and you want to put it in here, you can just put it right in the whole thing. Close it up and your sucker's in there. Is that getting dirty and sticky? I think that's a very cute idea. Mm -hmm. And I love it that you get a toy. Mm -hmm. I like the whole idea of it. Yeah. I, do, I do not know where these are sold, like in stores. No, we've never seen them around here. But no, I have not seen them around here. They might be a new thing. Yep. So I'm depending on you all to let me know. If you have seen these in stores in your area, let people know in the comments below. About how much do they cost? Because you are getting the container and you're getting the um, the little toy. And this is, I mean, this isn't something that's going to get, like if they get sticky all over their fingers, you can just wash these off in the mm -hmm. sink. Because they're, they're, yeah, they're hard plastic. There's no like fur or anything on them, which I like. I mean, so they could get them nasty as could be and you can wash that. Um, so yeah, let us know if you've seen them, how much they are, all those details. But I personally think they're just cute. Very cool. They taste good. Um, it, once again, it's www.yolocandy.com. I'll put the link below if you're interested in checking them out. We, these were sent to us free. We get nothing. If you go there, if you order anything, we won't know anything about it. Um, I'm just, we're just passing on the information to you, but I do think these are very mm -hmm. cute. Yeah, they're, they're it's something purpose. that I would buy definitely for the grandkids oh, yeah. to put in Easter baskets, stocking stuffer, mm -hmm. uh, anything like that, wouldn't you? Yeah, or just a little gift to take over to their house. A little whatever. prize or something. Yeah. yeah. Cause I like to give them little prizes, I'll, you know, have something in my purse. And then Amelia say, what's in your purse, Nanny? She likes to do that. So yeah, this would be that sort of thing to give them. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.